my ginkgo collections inspired by a ginkgo tree outside my, uh, my house down in the West Village here in New York City. Um, for those of you who don't know our trees in New York, um, there's so many ginkgo trees here in New York because they survive so well in polluted, congested, and difficult conditions. It's um, probably the oldest tree in the world. And um, for me, that sense of resiliency, that sense of the fortitude of the, of the tree that can survive in any type of atmosphere is, is just wonderfully symbolic. One of my favorite things in the summer is uh, opening my windows of the bedroom and the brownstone and uh, seeing the leaves blow in and, and sort of cover my bed. It's, it's really an amazing and, and beautiful sight. The ginkgo motif is expressed in many materials and techniques. The original and best loved execution is in metal. The design incorporates a very intricate sculpture that has details on both sides. The first step in the manufacture is sand casting, which utilizes a mixture of sand and molasses to create a temporary mold of the original design. The next step is filing, a craft that requires a great deal of precision from skilled and dedicated artisans. The final step is polishing. At Michael Aram, the polishers come from a long line of artists in the same field. The finish is only achieved through a series of buffing processes that must be managed without applying too much or too little pressure. Apart from the beautiful shape of the ginkgo leaf, it also symbolizes health, wellness, resilience, and peace. It's very powerful.